Hello my dear friends and welcome to my channel. My name is Barbara and today we're going to be looking at part of fortune and the sign of Gemini or if you have it in the third house this video might resonate with you as well. So part of fortune in our natal chart basically indicates where we're going to be having good luck, good fortune, prosperity, abundance. Sometimes it's going to indicate the career path you want to take Although with career, there are several other placements in your natal chart that you want to look at before picking and choosing your career. So good luck and good fortune for the part of fortune and the sign of Gemini or third house basically is going to get activated anytime you guys do Gemini like things. So this could be having a lot of friends, networking events, communications, PR, marketing, social media, talking, right? You have to speak in one way, shape or form. It's the written or the spoken word. So you guys could be interested in writing, okay? It could be short stories. The thing with Gemini is a lot of the time it's shorter things. So it could be things like Twitter or poems, these types of things. Maybe you don't share it with people. Maybe you just write it for yourself. You journal. This is going to activate good luck and good fortune for you. Also, the third house sometimes deals with siblings. So maybe you're going to have projects that you do with your siblings, or maybe you're going to be inspired by your siblings, and that's what's going to activate the good luck and good fortune for you. So this is my quick little video on the part of fortune and the sign of Gemini or the third house. If you guys did enjoy it, please do like, share, and subscribe. Let me know in the comments below as well, and I hope you all have a beautiful rest of the day.